I look really red in this. It's been really sunny this week, um, especially today. Even in Scotland, I know. Um, so maybe that's, I'm looking a wee bit red because I've got the sun. I'm also wearing a fire top, so. This girl is on fire. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I just want to say thanks for all the love on my recent cover of Blown in the Wind by Bob Dylan, which um, is now on iTunes and Spotify and everything everywhere. I will leave the link below to download that. Um, so go and check that out. So, I've seen a lot of people do this and I thought maybe cool if I did the same but also the talk of the town this week is iOS 14 Apple. Um, iOS 14 is coming, I don't think they've released um, like a date of when it is going to be but um, it looks pretty interesting, looks different, very 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 different from their normal like um, Apple kind of format so that'll be different and new when that comes in, I think it'll take a while to um, get to grips on but um, I thought I would do a what's on my iPhone, um, especially before that happens, so that we could even do like a compare video. That's what I'm thinking of today anyway. So that's what we're doing today. Like this video, subscribe, all sorts, let's just get into it. So I have my iPhone here. I got a new one this year, just at the beginning of the year, got an upgrade, woohoo. Um, and it is the iPhone 11 Pro. So the difference with that is um, from like the difference between the iPhone 11 and the 11 Pro is there's like a three camera Pro um, or however you would say it, three camera thingy um, and there might be other differences but I'm unsure of that but I do know one difference, the price. Anyway, not talking about that, my phone background is clouds because I like looking at clouds. So going through my phone. Um, it's pretty boring. <laughs> I wouldn't say I'm someone that's like got a lot of stuff on my phone, I don't know. Um, so here on this first page I've kind of just got the general usual stuff. Um, messages, calendar, photos there, which I have a lot of photos. Um, 6,000 recent, so mm -hmm. um, Camera maps, clock, weather notes. Um, yeah, there's nothing really too different here. Um, I've got a lot of emails. Whoops. Um, moving on to the second page. Now in this folder, um, this is a folder that I never go into. I don't know if anyone else goes into this folder. Does anyone else go into this folder? Let me know. But it's got all these like random Apple um, apps that they give you. So like voice memos, a compass which I never use, um, calculator which I do use at times, then all these like iTunes U things and numbers. Am I an accountant? I, d uh, I don't, I don't know. Um, and then things like stocks. I'm, I'm not a stock sh shareholder person. I, d I don't know what any of these things are for. Um, and then I've got a couple of things actually that I downloaded. Um, the, my guitar tuner for my guitar. To tune my guitar, self-explanatory. And my Bitmoji. So that's in that folder and that's just random stuff. And I've got my socials, um, Facebook, Twitter, um, Instagram, Snapchat, which I'm on. Pause this video right now and go and follow me here. Have you done it? Welcome back. Obviously I have YouTube, I'm watching the YouTubes. I have a pacer, which um, obviously I keep up to date with all my pacing um, around. And yeah, I do quite a lot of steps every day. Yeah. Yeah, I like to walk. And I got what's that? That looks like I'm popular, but I'm not. It's a group chat for my work and they're all talking nonsense. Um, yeah, I'm not that popular. I have Amazon, of course because I love Amazon and I buy everything off there. Um, that's actually my real card, which I don't use anymore. Um, yeah, I don't have a real card anymore, which is really sad. That's my bank. Don't look in there. There's no money in it. I also have Netflix, because I like Netflix. Um, and this is, this one is a little um, folder for photography stuff. Photography, not really. Um, so I've got Boomerang, um, I've got this Fuji app which my friend showed me which is really cool. I think everyone knows what it is, um, yeah it's pretty cool. Uh, then I've got like free prints, Snapfish and Cheers which are all really cool apps for um, like printing photos. So that's really cool because I love photos. If I ever do an tour one day, I mean you can even see I've got like photos and stuff around. I love photos so um, I love printing stuff out and you can do it in all different formats. Um, so I've got SoundCloud as well, this story art thing which is really cool, which you can make all sorts of different um, 
cool stories for your Instagram. So I'm really into that right now. I love making stuff like that. So doing that. ASOS is my whole wardrobe. I love ASOS. Like I'm 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 literally in love with ASOS. Um, I just everything I buy is off of ASOS. This is off of ASOS. I love ASOS. Um, so yeah, of course I've got their app. Of course. Um, that's for guitar there. Um, for you know tabs and stuff. Oh, this is a random letter thing. We played Stop the Bus over Zoom um, and FaceTime and all that as part of Corona, obviously. And to choose the letter for Stop the Bus, if you don't know what Stop the Bus is, you just go and it gives you, you just go like this and it gives you a letter, K. So that, that was that. That was my role in Stop the Bus. Got all four. Oh, that's a really good um, deli place. If anyone is close by here, Grady, have their own app, go and download it and you can get a great day delivered to you. Spotify of course as well. Then I am on Reddit, but I have no idea what I'm doing on Reddit. So if anyone could give me like a crash course on Reddit, that would be very helpful. Then I've got this really cool game called Dunk Shot. I love basketball, like it's my favorite sport, probably. Yeah. Um, and yeah, you just go and dunk some shots. Boop. Oh, well, I'm gonna sit and play it now. And um, see, so I've got that, and I've got my YouTube studio, then I've got the Snake Bees blog, which is another really good game. And um, Google Drive, a lot of people use Google Drive to send things to people, so I thought I better download it just to, you know, make things easier for myself if someone was um, emailing me something over Google Drive. Then this shortcuts thing, which is also a part of like the new iPhone. I don't actually know what that does. I've never been in it. Should we go in it? Let's see. Oh, it's nothing. I don't know what that is. Um, TikTok, of course. I am on TikTok. I can't remember my name. Let's see what my name is. My name is at Lynn's Brun. I'll put it here. Go follow me on TikTok. I'm not saying I'm very good on it because again, I don't know what I'm doing on TikTok. So a crash course on that would also be very helpful because I have no idea what I'm doing. And of course I have a Disneyland app. So this is for Disneyland Paris to keep track of all the rides, everything going on in um, the restaurants. Uh, wait time, maps of the park, whenever I'm going to Disney, I will download their um, app. And normally when I've just come back from a Disney holiday, I delete the app because I'm really sad that I'm back here and I'm not at Disney. And I downloaded this one in just March, just there, um, because I was going with my sister at the end of March and then coronavirus happened and we couldn't go. I still got it on, just in the hopes that We'll get back soon. Still hoping. Then I have Ticketmaster, of course, because it's good to keep up with them, um, all your gigs and stuff, which I normally have a lot of. But of course, <laughs> COVID. I then have uh, this Canva app, which is really cool. I love Canva, that's how I make all my thumbnails. And um, it's really cool for just making little logos and stuff. It's really fun, really creative. If you're into like creative stuff, um, download Canva. I have a lot of like silly apps like YouGov and Fiverr. Um, this Docs app, which I think is documents for iPhone, I think. Let's go and see. Oh, there's all these like silly things, I'm not gonna. And then I have this game called Archer Row, which is my favourite game in this entire universe. It's so much fun, it's so simple to play, but there's like so many different things to it, so many different levels. Like, honestly, if you love games, go and download Archer Row. It is so much fun. And then I have this 30 Day Fitness app, which I was going to start, but I think I downloaded it like more than 30 days ago. <laughs> I'm not started that yet. Here is, of course, next to the fitness app, there is a dessert app because there's a local dessert place um, in my area. And of course I've got their app because they're also delivering too. Then I have um, a couple of like edit apps like Premier Rush, which is quite good. Um, Photoshop Express, which I just downloaded. And I have My Sky because my Sky VIP, everyone. <laughs> then I have the Sainsbury's Smart Shop app. You need the Smart Shop app, guys. It's much faster, much quicker, less contact with other people, and it helps my granite as well. <laughs> then I got this Nietzsche app, which is, or Nietzsche, or I'm not sure how you say it. My friend literally just told me about this the other day, and it's kind of like the story art I was telling you about. Um, and you basically go on and you create like cool Instagram stories and stuff like that, which is pretty cool. And then on the last page, I have Uber, of course, for, um, those rare occasions when I'm out the house and I need to get a lift somewhere, um, 
got a wee of that. And then I got my Gmail, which is very backed up with emails, <laughs> which I don't open. Um, Disney Plus, of course! Everyone, if you've not downloaded um, Disney Plus, then I don't, I don't have to pay for it, but it's worth it, especially if you're like my kind of age and you've got That's So Raven, Liz McGuire, Hannah Montana, Wizards of Waverly Place, you've got all the Disney original movies. Download it. Uh, Apple Store, which I've never been into. Clips, which I don't know what Clips is. Oh, it's like a camera. And that's awful. I will never be going in there again. Garage Band, and then iMovie, and Keynote. And yes, I am aware that this part of my phone case is like scratched off. It is green and it's like a kind of rubbery texture. I've not actually had it that long. But yeah, I put it in and out my pocket all the time and the corners started like rubbing away. So um, I'm not like careless and stuff. Um, just the phone case that I've picked is unfortunately, um, it wears away. <laughs> um, yeah, then I've got my music down below, which has, you know, all my music on it. Oh. There's a little single there. Um, Safari, emails, and phone. And that's about it, folks. That's um, that's what's on my iPhone. Um, yeah, I, I told you I'm pretty boring, but I'm excited to see the new um, iOS 14 whenever that comes about. Um, I am I am an Apple kid. I do I do have to admit I do I do really like Apple. Um, so I do prefer them over an Android. But the iOS iOS 14 looks really Androidy and um, yeah, so really, really intrigued by it, but we'll see how it goes. Thank you so much for watching, and do not forget to subscribe down below and um, to keep up with everything that's going on here in this channel. And follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Lindsay Brun. And um, I think that's about it for me today. Yeah, um, I hope you guys are all well, and I'm going to go and enjoy this sun that we happen to have it's bizarre very bizarre i'm going to take the chance while we have it see you later